all right welcome back to the grace for comfort channel and this is relationship talk with kifi Duroji. and my name is kifi Duroji. and today this is the part two of signs of a bad relationship this is signs to flee when you find a woman whom you are supposed to think you want to date or go out with that will lead to marriage what you should look out for that is a sign that you have a bad relationship with her all right and the very first one is inconsistency when a woman is inconsistent it means you're not really her kind of man she's just trying her best to see if it works with you but now it depends if she was there the first instance and she was always available and it was working fine just suddenly she became inconsistent it could also mean that you did something that was not right you should go and find out what it did that made her inconsistent because it could just be that she's watching her steps and watching you and trying to tread carefully so she does not be sorry for herself at the last point so if she's a dream girl you go ahead and find what you did wrong and find out why she's inconsistent and work your way around it and i'm sure she'll be um, consistent with you and you guys can head into a very possible future together all right and the second one will be this if the woman is an ingrate all right how do you know an ingrate you can tell an ingrate from little things if you do some kind of things that you know you went out of your way to do that should be a sign of a gentleman gentleman and she doesn't even notice she's an ingrate it means that when you buy her a car if you like buy her a venza she will tell you ah i would have preferred the missus gl <laughs> wow yeah so ingrates are not written the forehead but you can sense them for minor Thing. so find out does she appreciate little earrings even if it's not gold if she appreciates them then she probably try her best and buy her gold and if possible diamond one day and she will be so so grateful she will remember all your kind gestures and you know she will reciprocate in her own way and be a loyal woman to you all right and the third one is this if your dreams are not alike um, then there is no need of going to such relationship. I know many men actually just get married to a beautiful woman or the woman they think looks the way they want the woman to look without comparing if their dreams are alike or if they even have the same vision. Okay, fine. Most times you don't have to have similar dreams or stuff. The woman wants to marry a successful man. To a reasonable extent, a first is successful, it's very good. But I know some women who I don't know if because they are timid they don't want you to be so rich because they get insecure or they will feel you might leave them or you begin to chase women or they don't want you they just believe that for you to become a billionaire or a multi-millionaire that you need to be a ritualist so how are you going to work with such a woman so one day you come back home and buy yourself a very good wagon and she says oh darling how do you get the money and she knows you've been working you've been making plans and things have been happening but she doesn't just sense them she doesn't even realize the the much hard work you put and your dreams of also becoming big and successful one day you should not marry such a woman because when you want to become a governor or if you have some dreams to become a politician or aim for such level she will pull you down i actually know a man that the wife was part of the reason we can tell or we can say or we can be correct to say that she, he didn't go so far in politics because when they call him off for many evenings or meetings in the evening she begins to cry and worry and say why will you be meeting in the evening don't go and don't go how many times will you miss meetings or when he dresses up very nice to go out she begins to whimper around him and and be like how's my looking so fine now people will start admiring him are you serious even when he's going to wear just men are such women i mean women should also be happy or admire the husband when they look good so if a woman is going to be just worried about you when you look good there's a problem she's not going to add to you she's going to be pulling you backward all right so such a woman is a no no or if the woman to on the contrary feels she should do better things she do more and become rich suddenly that means she's, she's okay if you have to defraud people if you have to go do anything your friends are doing just do something then that's the problem because she won't be saying no when you begin to go the wrong path because for all she cares you need to go and make her some money and the next one will be this 
she doesn't care about what you do to make money she just cares about the gifts the new houses the cars you buy she just find oh darling you bought a new car oh darling she doesn't even know what the company does or she just maybe she has an idea you know she doesn't really care what it is to do she just knows that my husband is rich and for all she wants is just the money the gifts and the presents the vacations and all that can be just to show off because that is selfishness one from such a woman and the next one with this due to her her way of life or how she makes abuse about everything you know your best self around her so around her you're working on on actions you're not sure if you say something if she's going to flee about it and say this is um this is harsh this is not good why do you talk to me like that what are you trying to say what are you insinuating you know when the woman becomes all imaginative she can picture things when the things are not even there it's a problem because you can't you can't be yourself you can't be the original of you the way you grew up the way the kind of man you want to be you can keep pretending around her until when you get tired of pretending also you see some people they have wife they have good home and you're wondering why is man always outside or why is he planning to do some things that you don't think he should be doing it is because he's not himself he's been living a pretense in his home he's, he's just probably himself around his friends so a man ought to be free at home and live his life and behave the way he wants to behave. Alright? That will make the man happier. But when he was on Hexia's, not good. She fantasizes about fairy tale wedding. She she already knows how the hall is gonna look like, what kind of gown, how many visor train she's gonna have, seven here, seven here, fourteen, how she's gonna buy the clothes and what they're gonna wear because she needs to prove to them she's marrying a wedding man. And you know deep inside of you you don't have that kind of money. <laughs> don't kill yourself don't bring her out snap her out of that fantasy on time or else you'll be forced to meet up with what she's doing you can lead it to borrowing or selling stuff or you know you say yourself in depth because she's always fantasizing of things you should do for her or buy for her and it will continue even after the wedding and it's worse when you're not mentioned wedding to her and she's just telling you about how her wedding is going to look like so that's enough time for you to know the kind of woman she is and the next one is that she's always right you know she's always like i told you no i can't be this i said this i did she's always right about everything whenever you guys have arguments she's too big to apologize she's right she's always going to paint a picture have a perspective from which you look at it and see that she's right that woman is trouble looking somewhere and the last one which is your bonus today is she's all about herself so all she cares about is you know she wants to do this you know her ex is to treat her like this when she drops the name of her ex at every time you guys are happy taking a vacation or doing something it's a problem you can't live your life with some, some other man's name in your head every time you're happy to your wife or you're fighting with your wife or something or your girlfriend is always talking about her ex to you it doesn't make sense it means she's just using you to get over the ex. It means she's just using you to wait for him to come back. Or worse still, she's just using you to get back to him. She's just wanting to see you and think that she's already, you know, forgotten about him and stuff. And as soon as he comes running back to her, especially when he's rich, she may just leave you. Alright, so thank you for watching and please share to your friends. And don't forget to subscribe. See you and bye. Go and find the right woman. Bye!